that is really going to boost your videos every single freaking time and it is guaranteed 100 percent guaranteed Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel. It's your girl Little Latina coming at you with another video and in today's video I'm going to be teaching you the top three things that are preventing you from growing on TikTok and how you can fix that and really expand your TikTok growth. And as you guys already know, I got my little fan. This is like my TikTok video fan so Let's get on to the video. So the first thing that you are doing on TikTok that is really preventing you from growing is that you are having very scattered posts. You don't post enough or your content is way too scattered and none of the videos are related at all. So without posting enough, that is something that I actually used to do quite a bit when I first started my channel. I would post one or two, maybe three times a week if I was really on top of my game. And that is something that you do not want to do. You wanna be posting four to five times a week three at the very least, like at the very minimum. Now, the reason you wanna do this is because this is gonna promote your videos more and more people are gonna be able to watch your videos. You're gonna have a larger audience range and people are gonna look at your channel and be like, okay, they post pretty frequently, so I'm gonna be receiving content of this style more often than not. So they're gonna be more inclined automatically just to follow you based off of that alone. And you always have to remember, consistency is key in literally any aspect of life and especially when it comes to social media and to any type of platform in general whether you're going to work all the time or whether you're working out whether you're eating healthy posting videos consistency is key and people want to see that and people want to see an account that posts pretty regularly so they know that they are expecting content and that they will receive content that they want to see on a more frequent basis so that is a very important thing but also on that note you don't want to be posting too much. So I only post once a day. I know some other people post a lot in a day, but I don't do that just personally because I just don't like it. I don't like when I would see someone's video on the For You page and then I would click on their account and see that they posted a whole bunch in that day. And I was just like, mm, no. And I would just leave because I just didn't like that because it was just way too much. It's way too overwhelming. And a lot of the time that the videos that they posted weren't really related in general. So they obviously didn't have that many followers or that much interaction with their channel. So if you are going to post multiple times a day, I would say two to three at the absolute most, probably more like one to two. That's just my preference and I just think that it's a lot easier for people to see what's going on in your channel and to interact with you when you do it that way because I know personally I really dislike it when I see people post more than two to three videos a day. So once you figured out that you need to post more and you started posting more often, you need to find a theme or genre to your videos because that is what's going to keep people on your account and that's what's going to keep people following you because they are seeing that you post a very specific specific style of video and that's going to keep people who are in that niche wanting to follow you and to interact with you and that's where the posting more often comes into play because they're seeing that you're posting the type of content that they want to see and that you're doing it enough so they're automatically going to give you a follow just based off of that. So if people were to go onto my account, they're gonna see that I post workout and health videos. So people like that, they're gonna be like, okay, I like that they're posting videos like that. And then they can see that I'm posting pretty often and pretty regularly, then they're gonna be like, okay, so I'm gonna see the type of content that I wanna see on a frequent, regular basis. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave them a follow so I can get notified and see videos of that type of content almost every single day or multiple times a week. So automatically that right there is going to boost your account and help you to grow right off the bat no matter what type of videos or what type of content you're posting. And that is one of the most, if not the most important things is to post regularly and to have a theme to your videos. And that right there, I guarantee you, once you start doing that, will help you to grow your account. Because I know from experience, when I started posting more regularly, I automatically 
quickly started getting more followers and I always had a theme to my videos because I always knew what I wanted to post so I didn't have a problem with that but I've seen so many other people that I know who have accounts that they just post random freaking videos all the time and then they wonder why they're not getting any growth on their account like that is why so don't make those mistakes because that is really going to prohibit your growth when you could be growing way more now the second thing that you are doing that is really prohibiting your growth and stopping you from growing is that you are misusing hashtags and hashtags are super 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 important this is honestly second most important thing from having a theme to your videos so if you are a new account or if you've had your account for a while and you still haven't seen growth and you haven't used any type of hashtags or you occasionally use it every now and then you need to start using hashtags on every single video and I know some people don't like hashtags or they think they look bad using hashtags like no you are not at that status level yet. You don't have millions of followers. You don't have thousands of people knowing who you are. Nobody's going to even know you exist and no one's even going to know to go on your channel or to check your videos out. And hashtags really, really helps to bring people in, especially if you're using trending hashtags or hashtags related to your video. That is really going to bring in more people and more viewers just automatically no matter what. If you don't use hashtags, start using hashtags immediately. So another thing I also see people do involving the misuse of hashtags is that they use way too many and they're super unrelated to each other and like it just doesn't make sense why you have that many hashtags. So for me, I use three specific type of hashtags. I'll use a for you hashtag, a video related hashtag, and a trending hashtag. So for the for you page hashtag, I'll only use that once or twice because there's just so many videos that have for you page on them. And plus all of those videos are gonna be so different from each other that when someone looks up for you page, they're not really gonna be searching for a very specific type of video, but that does promote your video and it does put you on the for you page, hence the name for you page. Now the second one, this is the most important hashtag per se, and that is the video related hashtag. So for me, I use hashtags related to the video that I'm making and that's what you need to do as well. So if I'm making a ab workout video, I'm gonna use hashtag abs, hashtag ab workout, and like hashtag toning abs or something like that because it's related to that video. And no matter what video you do, there's always gonna be some type of related hashtag. So you can't even use that as an excuse that your video doesn't have any related hashtags when it does. I guarantee you that it does. So I'll use about two to three hashtags that are related to my video so I'm not like overwhelming myself with all these hashtags. And then the last hashtags that I will use are trending hashtags. So I will only use about two to three of those three the, like the absolute most usually just one or two and the reason for that is because my videos that i post technically aren't really related to trending videos but by using trending videos you are boosting your video because you know it's trending so people are automatically just going to be looking through that and it's not really taking away from your video because you still have video related hashtags so it's just there to boost your video and, and whenever you click on the hashtag button automatically the top trending hashtags are going to come up up, so you don't even have to search for them. It's just automatically going to be there So once you're done putting in all your specific hashtags and your for you page hashtag That's all you have to do is just go ahead and click on the trending hashtags and then there you go You are done. No more hashtags needed. There you go And that is really going to boost your videos every single freaking time and it is guaranteed 100% guaranteed. And now the last and final thing that is really easy to fix, something that is really preventing you from growing and that is that you have poor lighting. So this is very, very key. I know in my experience, whenever I post videos that have lighting that isn't as good as I would like or lighting that isn't as good as I usually have, those videos will not do nearly as good as videos that have good proper lighting that actually looks good and that you can actually see what's going on. And like I've just stated, people aren't going to want to watch your video if the lighting is very bad because they're not going to be 
even able to see what's even going on in your video. They're not going to want to watch a video that has bad lighting and it's super easy to just skip past literally any video. So why are they going to stick to yours if your lighting is really bad? So you need to have good, nice lighting. Nice lighting can literally be just in front of a window like I do. That's where most of my lighting comes from. So if it's dark outside, I'm kind of screwed. But a ring light is a great source if you have the ability to have that or to purchase that. That is good for making videos. If you just have good lights in general, just make sure that you have good lighting because that way people are going to want to watch your video because they can actually see what's going on. And plus, if you don't have good lighting and people see that video on the for you page they're not gonna go check out your channel because they're gonna assume automatically that every video you post is gonna be of that quality and that is not a message that you want to send out because if that video for example gets a lot of views and a lot of people see that your video is of that dark quality they're not gonna go onto your account and leave a follow because people aren't guaranteed to look at your account just because they see your video you need to make people want to look at your account you need to make people want to be involved with you and involved with following you and interacting with your other videos and the first way that you can really do that the first good impression you can leave on somebody is to have good lighting on those videos and that is really going to keep people in your video watching it for longer and checking out some of your content or the rest of your content that you're posting and that is really one of the most simple one of the most easiest things that you can do to really help promote your channel and to promote your videos and it's just lighting like it's really just that simple so yeah those are the top three things that i would say is preventing you from growing and how you can change it and what you need to do in order to change it to help you grow on tiktok but with that being said if you really enjoyed this video or if you found this information helpful please leave a like comment or subscribe because that would just really help me in general and boost this video in the algorithm so more people will have the opportunity to watch this video but thank you for watching and mwah, have a beautiful day.